students today we are going to discuss the topic that is class reptilia class reptilia reptilia actually it is a latin term in latin reptum means creeping latin a reptum means creeping or a crawl creeping or a crawl the meaning of that name a class <coughs> reptilia so reptum is the latin term so reptilia means that is so creeping or crawling proctum anedi edutunno aa padam ane ardham ante crawl proctum ane antlo aa reptilia ane antlo proctum ane antlo ardham ane vastu సో ఇప్పుడు ఈ యొక్క జనరల్ క్యారెక్టర్స్ చూద్దాం సో వాట్ ఆర్ ద జనరల్ క్యారెక్టర్స్ ఆఫ్ దట్ రెప్టీరియా సో జనరల్లీ దీస్ ఆర్ కోల్డ్ బ్లెడెడ్ ఓవీ ప్యారస్ టెట్రాపోర్ట్స్ టెట్రాపోర్ట్స్ సో సమ్ బేసిక్ ఫీచర్స్ ఆఫ్ రెప్టీరియా cold blooded the body in the cold blooded organisms oviparous they can lay eggs and also tetrapods they have two forelimbs and two hind limbs and also these are mostly carnivorous carnivorous mostly carnivorous organisms right so generally the study of reptilia is called as herpetology herpetology herpentolus actually in greek uh, greek language herpenton means uh, reptilia herpentan means uh, reptilia herpentolus is the study of uh, reptiles have to remember that word uh, uh, study of reptiles is uh, herpentolus generally the body of reptilia uh, is divided into head neck region trunk and last but not least that is four regions are there right head region neck region trunk region and the tail region so these are terrestrial forms major terrestrial terrestrial forms some reptiles are present in water so aquatic forms are seen here so burrowing forms like uh, snakes also burrowing so terrestrial forms terrestrial forms of shrimp reptiles are terrestrial then if you see the exoskeleton like skin skin is dry devoid of glands so there are no glands in skin so skin contain some horny epidermal plates horny <coughs> epidermal plates plates horny epidermal plates and also some scales like scutes scutes and scales are present on the skin so as like uh, normally the amphibia contains number of mucous glands on the body that's why that the skin of amphibia is glandular but here we can say divide of glands means there is no glands on the skin so that's why it is dry so horny epidermal scales plates and scutes carapace like um, ఇంటర్టైల్స్ లో క్యారపేజ్ ఉంటుంది సో అలాంటి పర్టికులర్ పార్ట్ అంతా కూడా ఇక్కడ చెప్పడం జరుగుతుంది సో అలా ఉన్నటువంటి పార్ట్ ఏదైతుందో అది దెన్ ద ఎలిమెంటరీ కెనాల్ ఎలిమెంటరీ కెనాల్ దట్ మీన్స్ గట్ టెర్మినేట్స్ ఇన్ టు క్రోయాకా క్రోయాకల్ రీజియన్ క్రోయాకా కంటెన్స్ త్రీ కామన్ ఓపెనింగ్స్ రిప్రొడక్టివ్ ఓపెనింగ్ then urinary bladder opening and also digest to trap opening like canals so this particular part is called as cloaca this elementary canal opens into cloacal region so then the respiration is carried by respiration is carried by lungs lungs respirate milk by lungs pulmonary respiration at the same time heart contains three chambers so it is three chambered heart is present so three chambered heart but there is an exception 
the crocodiles contain four chambered heart except in crocodiles except in crocodiles they have four chambered heart chambered heart four chambered heart so normal three chambered heart is present then kidneys are metanephric metanephric kidneys are present metanephric kidneys these are uricoteric organisms uricoteric organisms means their excreted product is uric acid because they conserve water that's why they say they secrete they excrete urico uric acid as their excretory product then metanephric kidneys are present <coughs> Sexes are separate. Sexes are separate. Males have copulatory organ. Copulatory organ. So, hemipenis and epenis, the copulatory organs are present in males. So, mostly oviparous. Oviparous condition. Then, normally, fertilization is internal. Fertilization. A is a internal internal fertilization seen in the reptilia. So various condition of the reptilia condition of fertilization is internal. Then some extra embryonic membranes are arise are developed at the time of development. So those are embryonic membranes. So embryonic membranes, embryonic membranes developed. At the time of time of development, embryonic membranes at the time of uh, development. So during the development, there is a formation of uh, embryonic layers in reptilia. So then here we can see direct development. So development is a uh, direct. There is no larval stage. Egg one results resembles adult. Egg one resembles adult. So there is no parental care. Parental care is absent. Parental care is an absent. There is no parental care in a reptile. Also, some Jacobson organs, special type of organs that are present in a, our roof of mouth. So, these reptilia contain some Jacobson organs. Jacobson, Jacobson, sons organs present on the roof of mouth so here we can we have to remember this word Jacobson organs are present in the area they are present at the roof of the mouth or particular regions low around the matter if you see the examples of reptilia reptilia examples you see like that then chelone it is a estudo <coughs> Chameleon, chameleon, that is tree lizard, tree lizard, draco, flying lizard, draco, flying lizard, then hemidactylus, that is wall lizard, hemidactylus, it is a wall lizard. Wall lizard, hemi dactylus. Then Nasa, that is a snake cobra. Then Bungaris, Bungaris. Then automatically viper. So these are some examples for the reptilia. Thank you for watching. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.